You're watching the East Baton Rouge Parish Library Roadshow, everything you need to know about your library system. And now I have a very special guest, Blues Foundation board member and Reference and Computer Services Coordinator, Emily Smart. Emily, tell me about the Blues Festival. Well, the Baton Rouge Blues Festival is one of the oldest blues festivals in the country. It's um, really special and it, it, it exists, the foundation started it to promote and, uh, and celebrate our local blues heritage and we actually have a fairly significant local blues heritage. That's right, it's not just jazz, it's also the blues and this uh, festival's been around about 30 some years, right? Yeah, it started in the 80s and there was a little brief amount of time where they didn't have it and then in 2002 the foundation was formed. Mm -hmm. and. Um, that's when it started up again. Because at this point, festivals can't just be, come on down, we'll do something. It really has to be more organized. It has to be very organized, and they're, they've become a lot more expensive in yeah. recent memory. Well, so. well, when is this year's Blues Fest? This year's Blues Fest is on April 14th, that's a Saturday, mm -hmm. and it goes from 11.30 in the morning to 8 o'clock at night. So you can spend a day a celebrating day. Louisiana blues. Yes. And how much are the tickets? Oh, there are no tickets, it's free. Just like the library, That's everything's right. free, free, free. Well, who's playing? Because I love, the, I geek Ooh. the blues just like you do. Well, this year we're having two stages. Okay. So we're actually having more performers than we normally do. Oh, well, that's great. That's really wonderful. Our headliner this year is Johnny Winter. And if you're a person of a certain age, you will know Johnny Winter as a really fabulous blues guitar player and oh, singer. Yeah. He's from Texas. Um, Anyway, he's our headliner, and then we also have the newest blues supergroup, which is the Royal Southern Brotherhood. I just and like the name. It's a great name. Yeah. And uh, for the people who don't know them, uh, Dwayne Allman's son is in that group. Well, you've got some basically blues royalty coming yes. to this event. We definitely you? have some blues royalty, and we also have um, Lightning Malcolm and. Henry Gray, Henry Gray, That's James right. Johnson. Henry and James are both local mm -hmm. legends in the blues scene. Another local legend to be is Jonathan Boogie Long, who just won the Guitar Center King of the Blues Guitar Contest last in 2011. Well, I just love hearing the names of the bluesmen. It's awesome. And then uh, Little Buck Senegal will be a uh, appearing with Henry Gray. Mm -hmm. Then um, we do have a student group. We always try to include a student oh, group. Oh, that's great, to yeah. bring up a new group. And this is Baton Rouge Music Studios um, Young Nation Band Blues Project. Well, that's great. Now, is it just music? No. Um, we are going to have uh, a new thing this year. It's called Backstage at the Fest. It's going to take place in the old state capitol in the Senate chamber, I believe. Mm -hmm. And what they're going to do is they're going to interview um, Henry Gray, who is according to Henry, the oldest living blues pianist in the country and maybe the world. I can believe it. Yeah, he's he's 86 or 87 mm -hmm. and, and he's awesome. And mm -hmm. they'll be interviewing him and then Johnny, Alex Cook, local writer, right. is gonna be interviewing Johnny Allen, who's kind of like um, the godfather of swamp pop. Mm -hmm. And Johnny knows um, Johnny Winter, their friends, and he knows the, the whole history of mm -hmm. Music. Well, that's the library really likes that angle because we're all about oral yeah. history and preservation. Exactly. And okay. then we'll, we'll have a blues circle too, which will be kind of like picking and telling stories. Okay. Well, there's so much more that people will want to find out. Go to the Baton Rouge Blues, brbluesfoundation.org or Baton Rouge Blues Fest. Dot festival or, festival dot org, dot org yes. for the complete lineup because it even though the Blues Fest is just Saturday, there's some companion programs earlier in the week. Okay, well thank you, Emily. I am looking forward to geeking the blues. And in fact, um, the blues. yeah, we'll be we will be getting our geek on down at the Blues Festival. You'll see uh, the library outreach staff out there. Coming up after the break, meet Louisiana Lanyap with Dr. Charles Elliott. 